Building a better brain. Introducing the world's quickest, easiest memory system. This is video one. My name is Clive Cable. Welcome to the fascinating exploration of the parts of your brain you're not using right now. The more you use your brain, the more enjoyable your life becomes. Now, and then you'll want to watch all five videos in this series. Your brain is the only thing you've got going for you. And I'm going to show you not only how to improve it, but also how to improve your memory fast. And remember, I made you a promise. This is going to be quick and easy. In a moment, not right now, but in a moment you're going to see some images. At first, these images will seem a little odd. Yet after a short time, you'll find these images easy to recall. In fact, the more you see them, the easier they'll be to remember, especially when you start seeing results fast. And then you'll soon be impressing your friends and family. My aim is to make this quick and easy, fast and fun, simple yet effective, and each video is short. As you watch each one, every part of your brain improves. There's a concept called a rising tide raises all boats, meaning the more you improve one area of your brain, the more you improve other areas of your brain, the smarter you become. So let's get started with your first image. Now, I want you to imagine a cup of tea, which is the size of the room you're in now, and you're in there inside the cup of tea with a finger pointing upwards indicating you've gone under the level of tea for the first time. So one is T. Two is Noah. You imagine Noah with a long white beard holding up two fingers because it's two by two going on to his ark, which is behind him. Two is Noah. Three is May. You see three little girls dancing around a maypole. And on their dresses you see M, A and then Y. Three is May. So let's go over that again. One is T. Two is Noah. Three is May. Four is Ray. So you see a window pane divided into four, and there's the light coming through from the sun, which is the ray, and it's creating a, a, a shadow on the floor. Four is Ray. Five is Law. You see a policeman holding up five digits on his hand. Five is Law. Six is jaw. You see a jaw shaped in the shape of a six, like a wrestler's jaw. Six is jaw. Four, as we said before, is ray. Four equals ray. Five equals law, the five fingers the policeman's holding up. And six equals jaw. The jaw is in the shape of a six. Seven is key. So you see one of those old fashioned Yale key, keys and they're kind of in the shape of a seven already. Eight is fee, so you've got the high women's, uh, when they used to go and rob the stagecoaches, the little bags of money were shaped like, like this thing you see on the screen there, they're tied at the top, making the shape of an eight. Eight is fee. Nine is bay, so you see the a bay like this, um, with the shape of a nine and the islands in the middle, which is making the zero, the, the whole of the nine. Okay, nine is bay. You see a little ship going towards it. So seven is key, shaped like a seven. Eight is the bag of money, fee, shaped like the, uh, eight, eight fee. Nine is bay. And ten is your own ten toes. Okay, now this is going into your brain easier than you can imagine. So let's go over them again. One is T, two is Noah, three is May, four is Ray, five is Law, six is Jaw, seven is Key, eight is Fee, nine is Bay, and ten is your own ten toes. So 10 equals toes, your own 10 toes. 9 is bay. 8 is fee, shaped like an 8. 7 is key, shaped like a 7. 6, the wrestler's jaw, shaped like a 6. 5, law, 5 fingers, law. 4 is ray, the ray of light coming through, ray, 4. 3 is may. Two is Noah, 
and one is T. Okay, this is easy. It is going in, I promise you. I've been doing this for 30 years. Everyone gets it. So one is T. So you make that image of the large cup of tea. You're inside. You're holding your finger up. Yes, like that. Two is Noah. Long white beard, holding two fingers up. Three is May. Three little girls dancing around the maypole. Four is Ray. Make the image in your mind of the Ray coming through the window. Four is Ray. Five is Law, the policeman, five fingers. Six is Jaw, the wrestler's jaw, shape of a six. Seven is Key, you see a key, the shape of a seven. Eight is Fee, the bag of money, shaped like an eight. Nine is Bay, a bay shaped like a nine. And 10, of course, is your own 10 toes. Okay. Now, here are 10 things for you to remember. So I'm going to help you do this. And it's a lot easier than you think. To prove to you how good your memory really is, we're going to go like this. One is bananas. So you imagine this bunch of bananas being thrown into that cup of tea and it's dispersing the water. It's going everywhere. One is bananas. So you can see that going into the tea. Two is a loaf of bread. You imagine this loaf of bread with two little legs running up to Noah. Noah and saying, no, 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 it's got to be two, two, two at a time. Two, loaf of bread. Okay, so one is the bananas, two is a loaf of bread. Three is tomatoes. So you imagine the girls dancing around a big bunch of tomatoes instead of the maple. Okay, three is tomatoes. Four is red wine. I always imagine something come crashing through the window. So you can imagine this bottle of red wine and a glass of red wine spilling out all over, crashing on the floor. Four is red wine. Five is cucumber. Five is cucumber. So you imagine the policeman is standing on, precariously standing on this cucumber, trying to balance when he's holding up his hand. Five cucumber, uh, four red wine, three tomatoes, two loaf of bread, one is bananas. So you just make those images in your mind. One bananas, two loaf of bread, I'm running up to Noah. Three, the girls dancing around the tomatoes. Four, the red wine come crashing in. Five, cucumber, the policeman standing on the cucumber. Six is oranges. So you imagine you got this, all these oranges are stuffed in this wrestler's jaw and he can't quite eat them all and the, the juice is spilling out all over the place. Seven, coffee. So you imagine somebody's putting a key and winding up this coffee and the coffee cup and the coffee is just buzzing around. Eight is butter. So you imagine the fee plonked right into this butter and it's squishing the butter everywhere and the money goes everywhere. Nine is sugar cubes. You see a, a bunch of sugar cubes floating down the little bay. And 10 is newspaper. So you can see the, the newspaper balancing on your toes. So nine, you see the sugar cubes going down the bay. Eight, the fee goes into the butter. Seven, the coffee is being wound up by the key. Six, the oranges stuffed in the wrestler's jaw. Five, the policeman is standing on the cucumber. Four, red wine crashing through the window. Three, the girls are dancing around the tomatoes or tomatoes. <laughs> Two, a loaf of bread running up to Noah. One is bananas. So just we'll just go through them one more time very quickly. One, bananas. Two, loaf of bread. Three, tomatoes. Four, red wine. Five, cucumber. Six, oranges. Seven, coffee. Eight, butter. Nine, sugar cubes. Ten, newspaper. Pause the video now and grab a pen and write down all 10 items. Please pause the video now and write out as many items as you can recall. Okay, how did you do? Did you get them all? If you did, great. If not, then watch this video one more time. Everyone gets it either the first or second time. Okay, that's it for this video. This is the first of five videos. If you enjoyed this one, make sure you either find out how to get the rest or if it's better for you, email me clivecable at googlemail.com. Either way, you can continue to make your memory even better. And when you get to video number five, you'll be astounded at what you can do in such a short amount of time. You'll impress the people you know. So. 
Grab the next video and enjoy a far better memory. My name is Clive Cable and you can email me at clivecable at googlemail.com. That's clivecable at googlemail.com to discover how you can get the rest of the videos in this series. Okay, until soon.